Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here. So, as you can tell, hopefully by my voice right now, I am coming back at this campaign with fresher eyes than before, and we will have a great time, hopefully, and trying to get rid of Volpus's Legion. So, let me catch you up to speed. It's 2287, September 18th. Manpower, only 300 guys. As you can tell, or might have noticed, I've already annexed one of my puppets, and actually... By me annexing Tierra de los Tutsil, I was able to basically reconstruct and push even a little bit further back in into the enemy's territories. Now, uh, right now my guys are in the middle of moving around a little bit more and stuff like that. Uh, really, when I annexed Tierra de los Tutsil, it, it saved me. It really saved me. The manpower I got from that nation really, really helped me out. Um, obviously, we still have Honduras down here. Which I will need to annex, but I've been using a lot of their divisions, but we'll see what happens. That actually might be just enough manpower if I can annex them to push so hard into Vulpus's Legion that I can break them. Now, I don't know. Some of their divisions were looking pretty weak, but now it looks like, for the most part, they're mostly back up to speed. I mean, yeah, they have some divisions that have a lack of equipment, but some of them do not. So, as you can tell, my political power is not very high. I already used it to try to core, I think it was Tepic. Or it might have been something else. Actually, I can't core Tepic because it's, uh, I don't have any neighboring states that are already in my cores. So, I think I core somewhere around here, maybe? Um, maybe Tehuacan? I can't remember. But really, when I did it... When I core to state, it only gave me like 400 manpower. It was not even worth it spending quite literally over 1,900 political power for 400 manpower. Really wasn't cutting it. So right now, as you can tell, I've already cut down some of my other divisions. Just cut that one down too. That only gave us like 100 some more manpower. So basically, what this episode will be, will be me trying to micromanage my way to encircle, destroy more enemy soldiers. Uh, casualties. I'll show you casualties. I haven't lost that many more soldiers, really. Um, our allies lost it a little bit, our puppet, you know. I've definitely inflicted a crap ton of casualties on Volpus's Legion, which is great, but I have to micromanage this to make sure that we actually succeed in this fight. So, um, here looks like a good place. Ooh, and if we could take the radar station, that would be even better. So, let's take you guys, take you guys, except for you, and go ahead and attack that tile. Yeah. Will we be able to win here? We are only attacking with three, but we should have air superiority regardless. That's a lot of damage. Come here, and then we're going to attack this direction, and then circle those four divisions. Actually, how many divisions does Avolpus have? A little less than 200. So, less than what they had yesterday, but still, not bad. Um, Spec Ops were great. They helped hold the line in very many key areas. My puppets divisions are getting attacked down here, which is fine with me. Helps distract and maybe gets rid of some equipment or manpower of our enemies. Um, good, you're right here. Uh, I want to leave this area alone so the enemy might be baited into attacking us. But I also might want to do an encirclement. And who is better to do an encirclement than my spec ops? The cream of the cream de la creme of my army, really. So go ahead, hang out. Every month, we get about 186. So that's not terrible. That's not bad. But I do need to offer sacrifice to Hun Nal Yi. So if we have no manpower, I might as well take this, since it really won't hurt us at all. Um, yeah, other than that, there's really nothing we can do. Like I complained yesterday, I can't go up to minimal exemptions because we, can't, we have to be losing. Also, I decided to get rid of my focus right now, because there's really no point to do it. Ooh, commercial subsidies. Civilian factories for 30 days... I really don't need any more civilian factories, so, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, I didn't do the Grand Gulf Fleet, but we don't really need it either. And besides, if I make more ships, ships take manpower, and really, I really shouldn't be making all this stuff. So, um, I don't want to say I want to do this, but that's a combat one, that's a combat one. When those are done, just make me more co convoys. I think our navy's pretty good overall. I don't think anyone's really going to challenge us with our current navy. Ooh. And I, I really love this, since they're attacking my puppet's manpower. Actually, what is the manpower of my puppet right now? Honduras, where are you at? Oh, like, oh, that's a lot of manpower. They don't have a lot of divisions, because I took most of them. And it gives our guys some more training, so that's good. 
Um, still want to attack here, but they have four divisions. I don't want to attack with just. Uh, well, that's not bad. Mm, let's take our let's take our spec ops first. We're gonna attack this way. Go that way. Just try to encircle whoever you see. Nice. Do that. That'll be a nice little thing. And those four divisions couldn't hold out against me. Anyways, I have coffee here, but it's way too hot for me to drink right now. I am almost a coffee addict. Almost I, as I am a gaming addict. But not really. Yeah, not really. Cool. Ah, patrol boat hulls. Very nice, because I'm going to be using my boats a whole lot now. Sails, 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 and sails. Very cool. Come on, Vulpus. Keep, come on, Vulpus. Keep attacking me here. Yes. Give me my generals more XP as well as my divisions, or my puppets divisions more XP as well. Oh no, it looks like we might have a small little encirclement being made. Oh no, say it ain't so. Head straight on north. Don't let him move. Give me half of you guys. Come on down here. Very nice. Six, seven divisions. You know, it's not a lot, but I'll take it. I will definitely take it. Which puts us in a pretty good position to try to encircle some more of the enemy here. Now, I'm not just going to take land for no reason. The goal is to destroy Kaisar's divisions. So. Oh, they have less. Okay, the max amount has just gone down by like 20 or so. That's really good. Let's see. Spec Ops. If I have to, I will delete some of my own divisions to save manpower. But let's see. Let's see about this. Give me the spearhead. You will launch an attack here to here and then here and do that. We want to take that tile because it's connected in the waterways around here. Yeah, let them fill in. I want them to fill the line in. That's good. That's good stuff. Okay, we abandon the line. Okay. Not a smart idea, but not a terrible idea either. Are they attacking me anywhere? Um, I don't mind if we can maybe bait the enemy into attacking us on this little peninsula. So take you two. Come over here. Because 17 divisions is quite a bit. Actually, am I, are, you, are you using my own manpower? Because you're still... Oh, you're so it's sales divisions. Oh, some of you are. Some of you aren't. Huh. If I delete one of these divisions, do I get their manpower, seeing as they're gone? 633. Let's do an experiment. So you are 14 combat with. I don't want to get rid of you. You are 8 combat with. I don't mind getting rid of you. Why would you have a maintenance company? Anyways, um, so, let's see how, if we get any more manpower if I delete my puppet's divisions. Return the units. We'll go back to the manpower pool. All expeditionary forces will be sent home. Well, the country's gone. No, it did nothing. Okay. I'm glad I only chose one division. And that's a good lesson for everyone there. Very nice. Um, come on, guys. Attack me again here, please. Oh, okay. Thank you. Centurion or Aurelius. Thank you very much. Um, actually, attacking right here might not be bad first. Just because I can take that radar station. That could help us. And three divisions versus two. That's not bad. Tupel, do you have anything for me? No? All right, then. And we won the battle. Nice. Let's circle those divisions. Make sure these guys cannot move immediately. Fuel refinement. I'm not even using robots. You know, go ahead and attack. There's no really no point to not attack right now. And there you go. A few more divisions gone. I love it. Actually, I might... Uh, I might reconsider how I'm going to take out their division, so... Division for division, overall, we are generally better than Kaisar. Actually, we got a small little encirclement here. We might as well take this single tile to destroy another six divisions. <coughs> ah, 90mm twin cannons. I love it. Um, oh, yeah, I'm not even going to use that, so I don't really care. Ah, beautiful. Beautiful. Would you like to leave? Well, you will leave, but you will leave dead. Really not any better way for me to say it. Not bad. Yeah, just encirclements are the way to go right now, and that actually helped our front line a little bit better, too. Uh, are they still attacking us? Thank you very much. Porfirio Lozada. Level 5, yes, he's doing a great job. Great job. Actually, could you come this way? Who are you under? You're under this group. Um. What 
What would happen if I deleted these four divisions? It would give me... Oh, look at that manpower now. Nice. I love that. You guys do that. I want everyone to come here. Oh, don't. Don't. God dang it. Hold on. Do not do that. Thank God it's paused. You come this way. You come up here. Take that little tile. Because they might be baited into attacking my divisions right here, maybe? It looks like this division is... Someone going somewhere? Nice. I want all of you guys to come right here and see what happens. They might be baited into attacking three lone divisions right here. Or I can be smart about this and do that, maybe. If I can push through here, which it doesn't look like I can't, so I wasn't smart enough to move that fast yet. All right, spec ups. You're doing a great job. But, it looks like I might need to push the line up this way instead. Actually, no. We're going to do a bop to a bop to a bop. Another very small encirclement. Ooh, I can actually annex my other subject. Well, I need the manpower right now. That might not be a bad idea. 2,000 manpower. Welcome, 4,800, 480 more guys. Alright, thank you for your divisions. I don't really need them. Oh my goodness, that's all the manpower we're really going to be able to get here. You know what, I probably should have returned these soldiers to my puppet first so I can annex their manpower. But, whatever. Alright, so you guys should be able to attack here now. And circle five more divisions, destroy them. You guys, you're doing a great job. Attack here, and then come here. And then come here. And that's all you have to do. That's all you have to do. Uh, do we have any air support? Yes, we might not. Yes, we might not. Seven divisions should be good enough. Encircle those five. They actually do have a port, which isn't a good thing. But, and this is a huge but, we've got ships. And we're going to start convoy raiding those booties. If at all possible. It looks like they're struggling a little bit. Like they should be. Um, yeah, with the ships here, we should be okay in trying to find enemy convoys. If they're trying to send convoys. That's good. Hey, look, a little small encirclement. Four divisions only, but better than none. Hello there, uh, ships of Vulpus' Legion. You have no capital ships. Truly a beautiful thing to see. Oh, and there goes some more manpower through convoys and equipment. Good. We're doing better. We're doing better. Oh, hello there. They actually... Wait, they buff, they put more divisions here. Holy crap. Nice. Good. This actually might be a good area to maybe bait them into attacking. Maybe, maybe not. Or maybe I can attack them there. Uh, let's see. You guys aren't up to anything. So I'm just going to throw you right there. Even though that's a wrong army group. Whatever. Hmm. Oh, there's a lot of divisions over here. What I could do is attack here. Give me these eight divisions as well. That's really no problem. We're going to start inching our way closer and closer to meet up with the army group up here. Uh, I don't want to attack down here just because the waterways, and I need this army to move up as well. But we might be able to try something. Come here. Can you maybe reach that tile when you're done? Good. You guys, do that. Now, on the other side, we're going to immediately just push up. We need to start pushing up a little bit further. Nice. Good. This is a good way to bait enemies' divisions that are trying to reach these guys over here. Just destroy all their ships if you can. I know Kaiser Vulpus really has actually a few more battle cruisers here. So, it'll be interesting to see if they use them. Ooh, nice casualties, even better. So I'm feeling a little bit better about this. A little bit better. I don't want to push that hard into that territory. So you know what? We might hold the line up here for now. Send the spec ups down here. And I'm going to try to do an encirclement that will come all the way up here. This way we have both as many waterways as possible kind of already taken. Alright. Very nice. Very nice. Let's see. You can attack here. You have more than enough divisions, more than enough divisions, more than enough divisions to do that. Andreas, cool, unpause it. 
go ahead and keep start pushing a little bit more. You guys will be fine. Get take one guy there. That means these three can attack that way with another seven division support group. You three attack this way. You two attack here. Nice. Oh, do we we cannot build this area up, which is a bad idea for putting my spec ops there, but whatever. They have logistic companies. Logistic companies are great. Sixteen divisions, yes. Yes. Every time I'm sticking some more convoys, they come over here injured, and they're trying to get more supplies to make sure that these guys are okay. Yes, 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 yes. Alright, spec ops are mostly down here. Good enough for now. Go ahead and take those guys out, and then half of you guys will make it over here, which will be great. Man, how are we almost already 15 minutes into this video? Insane. Come on, guys. Put some more divisions down here. Oh, you're trying to attack. You know what? I'm going to do this. I'm going to start attacking, but I'm not going to... Uh, well, maybe I'm not going to win there. But um, I want to see if I can make the enemy put more divisions over there. Oh, yeah. Keep attacking me here, guys. Yeah, do that. That's great. Maybe I'll just let these guys starve it out. That does hurt their equipment, which is very, very nice for us. Ah, five more divisions. Glorious. Very good. We have a production. Very nice. Spec Ops, you are doing a great job. I knew I hired you for a reason. So now you're going to do come from here to here to here to here to up to here. And you will help guard against the waterways for now until I can crush the enemies down here. Oh, we got 200 more manpower. Nice. Recruitable population 197. So we're definitely doing alright right now. Not terrible, not bad. But uh, we have still, I still got to be careful because I can't really lose that much more manpower. Always be considerate of your manly power. Two pill, nothing. Pretty typical for you. Good, 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 good. You guys come this way. You guys keep pushing up a little bit. Beat all the other lines. If you're attacking that way, you can attack this way then. With another seven divisions over there. Give me, give me you guys. Give me you guys. You might be able to attack that way as well. Ah, very good. Cool. You guys, come there. And then, come there. And then, come there. And then, stop it right there. Very nice. Casualties, very good. We are really not suffering that many casualties, which is great. I can attack this area next with a few divisions. Take two of you guys as well. Take those guys out. We're going to encircle these guys. And then these guys will be starving for supplies, and we will sing happy, happy songs about it. And it is... Almost done. There you go. Go ahead, my friends. Take these guys out. Put them out of their misery. Make sure they never see the, the light of day again. You can attack me as much as you want. You're not escaping with those six divisions. No, no, no. You ain't crossing this way. You know Moses. No, no, no. That's right. Bringing in biblical references to a game that doesn't really need biblical references. Oh, I don't know why I said Moses, but whatever. You ain't part of that Red Sea. No, no, no. Hmm. Oh, my goodness. Now, I definitely need to push up through here a little bit so we can cover the waterways, which will be fine, but I could really use some more air support. I could use some of that. I could use some of that. I'm still building up so so stuff. Interesting. Interesting. Do I need more resources? No, I don't. But we're going to build crap anyways. Cool. Um, Very nice. Let our guys get reorganized a little bit first before I attack again. I definitely want that air base around here so I can help us out. Because attacking five divisions for, with two, not a great idea. Um, you might as well attack that area, I suppose. Do that. Do that. Um, I want to encircle... Oh, we can definitely encircle here. Take me, Give me these guys. Take two off. And then... Capture Ciudad... Quantec... Temoc. Temoc. Cool. And then give me half of those guys, and you'll come over here. Well, when you're done. Nice, very nice. Oh, they're oh they're actually attacking us around here, and they might be winning in a few different areas. 
Interesting. They're really pissed off at us. Oh, I can actually win that. Holy crap. Go ahead. Don't worry about that. My goal is to just destroy Kai's Vulpus's legions. And if they're injured, that's a great thing for us. That's right. You're going to suffer a lot more casualties than that, Vulpus. Oh, make sure you actually get over there before you leave. Yeah, there you go. And make sure you don't lose any more tiles. So, that covers those waterways. Over here, now I can make a fairly large encirclement. So do this, and then we will spearhead our way down probably to here. Cover... Ah, it's not a lot of divisions to kill, but whatever. Every division we kill makes us a little bit stronger. Comparatively. Alright, Spec Ops, you've had more than enough time to plan. Take all of you and come that way. And then come that way. Then come that way. Then come down here. And then beat these guys up. Because why not? Not a lot of divisions were encircling, but it's better than none. Are they still attacking? Okay, they still are attacking me. Oh, look at these divisions. They're a little weak. I'm loving how weak they are. Kaisar, you need to send some convoys to help them out. You have about over a thousand of them. Uh, are they starving? Uh, my ships are doing pretty well. Love my ships. I got actually plenty of extra ships. I got. Qu oh, these are and my al former allies' destroyers. Let's see. If we destroy these, we get no manpower. Well, I don't want to use garbage. What are these designs? Uh, I'd rather just use what I have right now. So, I don't really get that much manpower, but whatever. Nice, nah, so we got a couple more fleets we can make. Uh, that's not bad. Where are you wanted to hear? Do some more convoy raiding. Uh, I'm not really worried about my energy fuel usage, or energy cell usage, I should say. Uh, give me one of those, and give me a level 4 battle cruiser. Oh, wait. Um, you know what? Recombine that. I didn't make it 8 of these guys. 8, level 4, and then give me a level 1. That's good. That's better. Nice. Alright, not bad. Ah, uh, we made it. Now there's small encirclement. I love it. I love encirclements. Well, I love encirclements when they work out for me. Not when I get encircled. Hell no. I hate that so much. But I love encircling the enemies. Good enough. Go ahead and come that way. Mm. Volpus's Legion... They do have some strong soldiers, but strategic soldiers, or strategic planning, they don't really have a lot of. And we made another encirclement down here that I completely forgot about. Glorious. And actually, if I just keep using my spec ops up here, like this, we're going to be able to kill a crap ton of enemy soldiers. We're going to do the same thing. It'll come from like here. Oh, let's come up here. To there, to there, to there, to there. There, to there. Encircle all these other guys. Guys are, or... I keep saying Kaisar. Vulpus. We're just going to make sure that we just keep encircling. You guys are good enough. Go ahead to do that. Take off two. Come down here. Take off two. Come down here. Take off two. Come down here. And then take La Junta. La Junta. And then attack that tile. Off you go. Vamanos. Nice. And really, it doesn't matter if we attack here, so... Oh, let you guys all hold. Well. I'll let you guys do whatever you need to do. Oh, we might be able to do an actual smaller type of... Ah, uh, well, the, the, all these guys are good encircled with my spec ops coming down the line, so... No real worries about that. Okay, they're still attacking me. These divisions are still dying. And I'm enjoying watching Vulpus's, Vulpus lose his men. We haven't really lost that much more manpower, which is great. I do want to bait them here. Uh, are you, you're, are you like, are you a mime? Like you're, you're moving, but you're not really moving. Get me happy, you guys. I might be able to bait these guys a little harder. Now, they don't have a lot of divisions around here, but that's okay. Ah, look at that! It's almost a triangle. I love shapes. Ah, just go ahead and start doing this. Just kick them to the curb. Kick them like, kick them to the curb, as if they're homeless. Oh my goodness. We're not in California yet. Oh. Um, do that. Do that. 
do that and send that spec ops division that way, please. Actually, you stay put. Beautiful. A couple of divisions overran already. Very nice. Oh my goodness, I didn't even count how many divisions that was. Oh my goodness gracious. Ah. Oh. And no one even really cared about all those men dying. Beautiful. So you guys are up there. Paddle, paddle wheels, nice. So I'm going to keep doing the same thing here. Obviously, I will move things around over time. But, Spec Ops, you're at, needed again. And this time, we're going to cut off right here. What we're going to do is we're going to make a thing like this. That'll be good. Division-wise, Vulpus has lost at least 12 divisions that way. Come on, send some convoys this way, man. Come on. Since this is not my manpower, I don't mind using these guys. Can five divisions attacking over a waterway destroy 14 divisions with a little bit of air support? Maybe. Maybe. Truly beautiful. All right, so I don't want them to navally invade me in the butt. So I need you over here. Um, Yeah, this would probably be a good idea to do this type of stuff. Oh, actually, I have you guys down here. Oh, actually, I have an extra army I forgot about. Truly a great timeline. Not bad. You coming over here, boys. Boy, you coming over here. You guys. Mmm. I don't really need you over here. Um. You guys. Get rid of this all of you and then you four you guys come over here help support your troops support your troops guys support your troops you guys you 16 go ahead and do that and take as much land this time yeah do something like that I kind of messed up on the placement but that's okay oh fire extinguisher very nice can I make another encirclement with just my regular divisions? Well, we might need some more air power here. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Do that. Maybe a little bit more of uh, infrastructure and stuff like that. But I am still keeping an eye on my manpower. Not too much of an eye, but a little bit of an eye. You guys, take these guys out. And then we'll take El Mesquite. And then half of those groups will come up that way, and then you will attack soon up here. There you go. And we'll circle only one division, but that's okay with me. Only a singular division, but better dead than red. Or I guess in this case, brown. Go ahead, my friends. Unleash hell, as some would say. Um, you really don't need to do that right now. Let's go ahead and do this, and we will be able to form a better front line. Oh, we definitely need this area. Yeah, I can't take that just yet, and that's okay. And that's okay. Nope, my coffee's all gone. Oh, well. Let's see. Bendito. Oh, no, not Bendito. Benito Juarez. Ah, uh, yes. Twelve divisions right there, stuck, wondering if they'll ever survive this war. And I'm gonna let them know. I'm a fortune... I'm a soothsayer. Fortune teller. You ain't gonna live. Ah, oh, look at those great cons. They also died there. Beautiful. Truly beautiful. Alright, you guys. We're doing a great job encircling a bunch of soldiers. We're doing the same thing right here again. We're gonna push from here to all the way to pop that way. Um, oh, look at those divisions. There's very few divisions there. Um, we're doing very well, guys. Very, very well. As long as you don't get frustrated, or as long as I don't get frustrated, we'll be we'll be doing okay. You guys come this way. Take out two guys. Take that way. Take that two guys out. And come up there. Followed up with an attack that way. Come over here. Come over here. And then come over here, and then do that. Now that's a very snaky, snaky, snaky type of encirclement. But we'll see what I can do. And actually, we are... We have another army group that we can use. 
Hmm, it's almost as if I should put you over here, and then put you over here, so we can form one heck of a massive front line. Huh. Right, Bink? I'm also joining about my cat, but we are running out of time. Right, Bink? You okay, big boy? You like sleeping in my room? He loves sleeping in my room. He's a great big boy. And actually, I made a mistake. I need to click on you to do all of that. Beautiful. All right, Spec Ops, do your thing. Do your thing. It's 2288, June 2288. We've been playing this game for quite a while. But this will be the second last episode. The next episode will be the last episode in this campaign because I'm already practicing, or trying out, the next campaign. And if you're wondering what mod I'm going to use, it's not going to be Old World Blues. It will be a different mod. A mod that's very, very well established. A very great, fun, good time. Well, hopefully it'll be a relatively good time mod. That I actually haven't played in quite a while on this channel. So... Alright, and we might get encircled ourselves. This will be the last encirclement, and we've done another tremendous job. You guys come this way. You guys come up here. You guys aren't really ready for anything. And you guys come down there. And my cat wants to leave. Give me one moment. Bye, Bing Bing. Bye, Bing Bing. Have a good time. Alright. Ah, oh, Binky, he's a special kind of guy. Mm. Oh, they're panicking. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. So, because these guys frustrated me last time, like, in revenge, or for for revenge, do I crucify them? I mean, that, that sounds like the, the right neo-Roman thing to do, I guess, if I was playing as Vulpus. But uh, I guess I'm playing as a Mayans. We're, so we're just going to do a bunch of human sacrifice instead. So, all right, you guys did a great job. We're going to let our guys reform our front line. Um, Spec Ops have done a trem tremendous job. Where the heck are your divisions? We might push extremely hard next time. Actually, we will push extremely hard into Kaisar's Legion. Vulpus's Legion next time. Um, uh, yeah. So, guys, hope you enjoyed this episode a lot more than yesterday's. I know I was a little ragey, but that's what makes my channel special. Anyways, guys, leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord below. Look how many divisions Vulpus no longer has. And look at the casualties that we've caused. Thank you very much for watching, guys. And I hope you all have a great, great day.